Hey guys, Big Will coming at you from the Plastic Rod Shop. Man, I've been working on this 48 hour build. It is coming out so awesome. Oh, I've been watching videos. Chevy Cheeseburger, that Corvette's going to be sharp. Love that color. Um, Alan Spencer, he's got that Camaro, that Concept Camaro. That thing is neat. Um, don't know. I haven't seen any of the other guys' videos. There's a few more, I think. But um, I've been working on this thing for non-stop. <laughs> I just want to touch base with you guys. Show you a little update on what I got going on. It'll be done within 48 hours. I'm real sure of that. <laughs> um, a lot of fabricating. A lot of um, sanding and grinding and cutting. And you, you just don't. <laughs> it's it's been it's been so much fun. I I've been having a blast here. I've changed it up a lot since since um. I was showed you last. Um, yeah, it made a major change. <laughs> I um, was going to put a small block in it, but I found this Hemi that I had in my um, drawer, my um, parts drawer, and I got it. It's going to be cool. I put a Hemi in it, put a blower on it. Um, I found some big fat slicks that I, I had got, I actually won them slicks. They came in a bunch of, um, extra parts and stuff that this guy sent me for winning, uh, coming in second place on a build off on Facebook and CT, I seen CT had a question. Great question, CT. It was, what got you back into building models in the hobby? Um, well, I got a kit from my mother-in-law. I don't know why she got me a model, but it was a 55 fleet side. I never even finished it. Heck, I think I screwed it up, honestly. I think the, I broke the... I broke the um, front axle and I got kind of discouraged and I thought I'll keep the parts I'll build something out of it and that's another build that's on the process but I started getting on Facebook and YouTube watching people building models and I've seen a lot of great people you know in both places, Facebook and the um, YouTube. So I bought a bunch of models, had them in a box, got them from I don't remember one of those websites, and <clears throat> I was in the process of moving and stuff, and I started watching all these Facebook and all the YouTube stuff, and I got finally got moved. I said, you know what? I'm gonna build it. And then I was hooked. Styrene hook it, it styrene got in my blood, I think. <laughs> and it's been a blast ever since. I mean I've spent a little bit of money, but it's not nothing that you know, that's my beer money. I don't drink anymore. I don't go to the bars anymore. Uh I used to do all that and just something to get away and bring back my youth and what I used to do when I was younger but it was it's it's a fun hobby and I have a blast doing it and you'll see once you see what I'm building for this 48 hour build you'll say yeah he's having fun all right so let me get at it I won't burn years up too much longer and show you what I got what we got going on guys 
Let me move this box out of the way and give you a look-see. I've changed her up since the first video. Getting close. Made them wheels out of the wheels that came in the kit for them big old slicks. Um, putting the Hemi in it with the blower on it. I had to modify a lot of stuff on this one. Um, got it painted. Still got to clear it yet. But now she is coming out good. It's all, it's not put together or nothing. I just, I just got it set up here to show you guys. Putting them zoomies on there. Made them myself. They're not the best, but back in the day, you would hot rod them out. That's what you do. I still got to weather up this, or I still got to put a little, um, Sand up the tire, look like it's weathered. I did the front ones already. Uh, we got the zoomies, got a hemi going in it. Um, can't really see the interior, but I got a little bit done on I did little details and stuff on that. I don't know. I need to get a little light so you can see inside. It's all black interior, so um, but yeah. That's what it's going to look like. That's what it's going to look like. It's going to be pretty cool. I, I've changed it up a lot since you've seen the last video. But, uh, no, it's... It's going to be a bad machine. Well, that's what I got, boys. It's coming out pretty good. I'm trying not to rush. But I've been working on this thing for hours. I bet I worked on this thing 10 hours yesterday. Just non-stop working. Cleaning and sanding and grinding and... Oh, you just... Yeah, you name it. <laughs> but, um... Uh, Tell me what you think. I've got it all ready to be put together. Other than wet, uh, wet sanding and then clearing the body. But it'd be done tonight. Should be. And I'll have another update. If it's not done tonight, I'll have another update tomorrow being final. So tell me what you think. This is Big Will at the Plastic Rods Shop. I'll talk at y'all later.